all look the same. So they finally crack you open into these. And it also gives you a sense of scale of how big Aperture is. Because you don't really realize when you're in these little rooms, the place is just ginormous. It's like the size of a planet. And some of these areas will break open, and you'll see, like, these crazy vistas. Yep. And I just felt like they did a good job of pacing the whole thing. You never stay in the test chambers so long that you get sick of them. Right around the time you start to be like, okay, now what? They'll jump you out of that and start putting you into the more action-adventure elements. Like, just very... I guess the one word I would use, and if we did a one-word review for this game, which we used to do, it would just be smart. Yep. I mean, playing the game, the people who make this game are way smarter than me. The design choices they made are smart. The way they pace the game is smart. Uh, you feel smart after you play it. You're like, man, I'm not an idiot. I figured yeah, And that that's out. a different feeling than yeah. what you feel with most games. And you that's you go why through, I haven't uh, played it yet. <laughs> <laughs> makes you feel good about yourself. Yes. Oh, but, no? Yeah. yeah, that's. I mean, that's what I love about Valve too. I think it's like an interesting evolution of the company because they've done so many, you know, hardcore shooters, and now this is like the game's rated E10 plus. It's mm -hmm. like you know, I think it appeals to a wider demographic of folks. It's just you know, it's a game that can push the industry in kind of a new direction. Sure. It's had a very um, smart ad campaign as well. The yeah. TV, TV ads in word particular. Uh, yeah. You know, <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, but yeah. it is you know their, their ad campaign. Uh, you know, people have been probably seeing it all over the shop. It's you know, it's kind of cute. It reminds you of Wally -E to start off with, so it sucks those people in, and then it's like you know. It's time to play with science, and that yeah. and that is going to uh, you know inspire parents to go and shell out sixty bucks because yeah. mm -hmm. wow, this isn't a shooter where people get killed. It's all about physics, and it's about you know uh, problem solving. It's smart. My big complaint with it is that there really is no replay value. So even after you finish the game, you don't get a lot of the bonuses you got yeah. at the end of the first portal with like yeah. the time trials and all that. Also, cooperatively, there are no leaderboards, so it's not like you can yeah. see how quickly a, another tandem finish something and try to beat their time. So I feel like maybe the end game could have been a little better supported, but yeah. what you get that's on the disc for the time that it lasts, I think, is is awesome. It's, yeah, and I'm sure it's worth do... sixty bucks. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. No, yeah. Well, I mean, I mean, it's you know, it'll be, I'm sure, a, a game of the year uh, contender. I mean, you know, it'll a lot certainly of be stuff. in the discussion. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there'll be a lot of stuff coming out, obviously, towards the end of the year, but you know. Yeah, for the first half of the year, it certainly is uh, you know the biggest release, and you know I think people were expecting it to be good, and I think it fully delivers. So your best game of the year so far? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I'm borderline. I still Where's enjoy it? Dead Space a lot. Yeah, no, Dead, Dead Space is up there. I mean, there haven't you know the interesting thing is like last year. I remember I was having these discussions with our VGA producers, and it was like you know by June there were legitimately probably like four or five game of the year contenders that had come out. Mm -hmm. This year, it's like. There hasn't been anything near that. I mean, last yeah. year you had Mass Effect out by now. You had God of War. You had Red Dead about to come out. Yep. Super Mario Galaxy was about to come out. Um, you know, a lot of big games have come out. And this year it's like, yeah, it's 